So Darren, now you're officially part of the secluded Sea Firefly Fellowship. Can you tell us a little bit of your experience yesterday and all uh, the things that you understood? You have already seen them. Uh, you're a returning customer at LKR, so so it was not new for you in that sense. But uh, now it was different because you 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 followed the program and. Now we know more. Absolutely. I, I love Roatan. I love the underwater topography and the diversity of fix, fish and, and the accessibility. But the single most wonderful experience I've had that I've had nowhere else in the world is uh, is the, the, the fireflies. Last year, I saw them for the very first time. Um, I, they were called String of Pearls, and I totally didn't understand where the hell these things came from, but they were the most amazing underwater display I've ever seen. I've tried to research it since, and I really haven't found anything. And so when, when we came back this time and we saw Jose and he was giving a special bioluminescence dive, um, we were all over it. What I didn't really realize is that we were going to get an actual seminar on on what all the questions that I had about where these string of pearls were, what they actually were. They're actually it's very very interesting. I can't explain it now. It took an hour for you to explain, but wow, what an amazing creature that's able to do this all for mating, which I can kind of understand. But uh, it was absolutely fantastic. I recommend this as as the the most. The best dive experience I've had here on Roadtown and probably anywhere else. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you for those kind words. One other question. What do you think about the other bioluminescent stuff? Because you understood that there's not only sea fireflies that they produce their own bioluminescent, bioluminescence, but we have got a chance to see more dinoflagellates. We got the chance to see the ostracods having attacks by the a cardinal fish and i want you to to tell me more about the experience on the because you remember that i showed you that the, the, the guy that that that, that twirls all along my fingers and yep. it, it lights up but then you told me that you had I had them all, all over my leg and stuff, so I I, I want you to re <laughs> yeah. to, to so, replace that. After the after this dive, I like I never want to go on a night dive with a light again. <laughs> 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 I mean, so so we jump in the water and uh, and it was a little bit early because we were on a boat with a night uh, they're doing a night dive with a bunch of other people and it kind of started out slow and I had done the thing where where sort of you you wave your hands and sometimes you see a little spark or whatever, but then then as it got later and you got down in the crevices and you you got to to, to the barrel sponges and the sea fans and all of a sudden you were getting things to light up that I never knew how to light up and they would light up not just like as a sometimes it would be a sparkle of lights but sometimes it would be like uh, like uh, an octopus's tentacles where everything lights up all along the tentacles and I swear one of the times it was like around your leg it was like lighting up I saw Jose's entire leg wrapped in these like sparkling tentacles it was absolutely amazing me and Francesca were going what the hell is that it was so so cool and uh, and we we saw so many things so we got to see see the 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 uh, see fireflies uh, in in the shallows and and a whole strings of them uh, you know kind of leaning in the current it was it was amazing you see now what it was, when when I, when we were on the briefing uh, one of one of my theories that I need to prove how they tilt regarding the current yeah. remember but because we <laughs> tell about it well what, yeah so so I mean. They, they're all aligned like in the exact same way, whether it's straight up and down or it's a little bit tilted or, or, or whatever, but they all seem to know that uh, that it's the same thing. What I didn't understand is I thought all these little lights were connected like a string of lights. But what Jose explained is it's actually this fast moving fish about the uh, fast moving uh, um, shrimp, let's say, kind of a shrimp. <laughs> okay. The size of a sesame seed and everything that you actually see is a little burst of light where it used to be and is no longer there. And that concept like never registered for me. And I was like, I didn't even believe him. So I was going through that. I said, no, this is a string of beads. I'm gonna put my finger through it. It's gonna come with me. Nope. There were all of these like little, little ghost bioluminescence blips that just remain in the water column and it's so so beautiful it was it was amazing i really appreciate you trusting uh, uh myself and, and and on behalf of all anthony skis staff especially uh for instance uh, don julio and samir galindo they have put a trust in this project and they are 
uh, they are becoming pioneers in the whole Caribbean region. So I gotta thank them and, and we, uh, we express our gratitude on trusting and being part of the first ones, uh, you know, to become of the fellowship of the Sea Fireflies Brotherhood. Uh, in the future, I know this young lady we're gonna take her on, I hope so, so so she can yeah. see them. And many thanks, Darrell. Uh, thanks to Francesca as well. She's always busy, busy with mom duties, you know. But uh, I'm sure this is not going to be la the last time I see you. I, I know it will be. And listen, brother, I appreciate all the background that you gave me with the seagrass and the interrelationships between that and the sea fireflies. The it blue carbon is really it important. Made the, it made the experience. Do you think it's worth it? All, 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 all yeah. that, that experience. Okay. Yeah. I'm really happy. Uh, thank you, Darren. Take care. You got it. Dad, I saw a baby banana. You saw it.